day 769. And this one is excited. She knows where we're at. Where are we, puppy? Where are we? Where are we? You ready to go? You ready to go? Okay. She knows where we're going. She knows. Back at the park. All right, quick party break. I'm ready to run. And it begins. Come on, let's keep it running. Keep it moving. Oh, not a good start. Come on, come on. There we go, now we're going. Take a little break. Little baby steps with this one. I think she's excited and looking for squirrels and rabbits again. All right, you ready? Good girl, Gamora. Good girl, come on, keep it running. Keep it going, let's go. There you go, easy. Easy, easy, easy. My goodness, puppy. She found a little bird she wants to try to go play with. You're okay. You're okay. Which way are we gonna go? You wanna go that way? You gonna go backwards? No, that's not the way we're going. Okay. Alright. You smelling something or are you trying to eat something? Which way are you looking at? Nice and easy downhill, puppy. Stopping already? Come on, Mo. Right here. How you doing? You good? All right, just made it back to the car. Got the pup some water. And gave her a little ice cube. She just spat it out. There's a little water mess. She's good. So we're just gonna go walk around a little bit. Enjoy a little bit of the day. You got plenty of time. It's still nice out. It's still really nice out, actually. So, might as well stay here at the park. Made it to one of the top of the little hills. I don't know if you want to call it a mountain, but check out the green bed in the back. Another way is just trails and park. Phoenix Zoo is somewhere over in that area. Parking lot. That's the parking lot. So the Phoenix Zoo is probably right in there. That whole area. But oh cool. I just started walking this way and the pup kept heading up. So I started walking up. We got maybe 20 feet from the top. She started turning around. Like, no, 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 we're going all the way up. We're going to finish what we started. Get up on top of the hill. And what a great view. Huh, yes, here's the happy puppy. There's the happy puppy. How cool. Good girl, good mama. Good hike, well done. You have a good hike? Yes, puppy. Going off trail. You're going off trail. Where are you going? Come back to the trail this way. All right, good girl. Everything good? No puppy treat? All right, puppy treat. Bacon treat? Good girl.
You're so happy after your hike, huh? Yeah, I just need a little playtime. A little time to run around. That's all you need. That's a happy puppy. Oh, love the head scratches. Love the head scratches. All right, good girl. Good girl, good momo. Good girl. Okay, let's go. You okay? You can sleep, you're okay. I got some laundry going. Pops keep me company. I'm gonna try to add up for the last couple months of all the runs and all the fitness stuff I've done. It's gonna take a little while. I'm gonna get all the miles, which I know the miles already. But I'm gonna try to get in the push-ups, pull-ups, core stuff and see what it looks like and then I'm not, I got a new board it actually was a new board I just had some old stuff in there from like a year ago gotta clean it up and I'm just gonna add on here just January the total February and then March and I think it'll be easier to keep track of it as I go instead of at the end of the month or two months later three months later trying to figure it all out project, a little math. Someone's leaving again. Okay, here's what I got so far. Added up all of January, get into February, I just got all the miles for February. And then I'm gonna go back through and I have my February board. So I gotta add up all the fitness stuff outside of running. And then, I don't know if I'll have time to do March, but the laundry's got done. Someone's sleeping again. But I have my buddy's birthday at 6, so I'll probably try to head out at 5.30. And I'm going to have to walk the dog before then. She's definitely worn out right now. So I'll give her a little chance to wake up, and then take her for the walk, and then I'll be ready to go. And have a little dinner. And probably his birthday cake. I imagine there's gonna be some cake, dessert. Maybe I'm just hungry and I'm thinking about all kinds of food. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. All kinds of food because I didn't eat too much after the run. I thought I was gonna get lunch and I didn't. I just started doing laundry, started doing all this little stuff, the fitness stuff the math brains brains doing all right but it's starting to wind down need a little break maybe that's what the clothes will be for so fold some clothes put those away come back add up the rest of the math for February I right, can ready to head out I need to pop some food so she has dinner while I'm gone all right pup. puppy food there you go, and your puppy treat. Puppy treat, sit down. Good girl, go get. Go ahead, you're good. All right, be a good girl. Go ahead, you're okay. Okay. Just finished dinner with my buddy and his family. Now we're over here getting him 
Some crumble cookie. Right, buddy? Say hi to the birthday guy over here. Hello! <laughs> Get, get this guy some birthday cookies. All right, so my buddy had to head out. He had to get back, but we did end up getting a couple of cookies. He got four, and I just got the one. I don't think I need more than one. I just, after that candy binge last week, I got to cut back a little bit, but look at that tasty cookie. I think it's a raspberry cheesecake. I just, we're going through the all the flavors they had and they said they had extras from last week and so they had more a more variety than usual I said like, which one's that and he's like oh it's raspberry cheese and I'm like that's the one I want just give me the one with the fruit and the raspberries and I'll take it I'm gonna try to save it for when I get back yeah I'm gonna save it for when I get back I'm not gonna try to eat it right now in the car it's gonna be a mess all right on the way back made it back to the apartment decided on not eating the cookie just because I think I already ate too much at dinner and two I, I forgot that I didn't have anything prepped for tomorrow for lunch and I have some peanut butter and, and some sandwich stuff so it looks like it's gonna be a light lunch so a nice tasty crumble cookie treat would be nice to help enjoy the food for tomorrow I think I got two bananas and some blueberry bread so it's enough to hold me over but just thinking back I was like I'm probably gonna be able to enjoy this more tomorrow than I am now if I'm feeling kind of stuffed and full so tomorrow I'm sure I'll be hungry but tomorrow it should be just as great so just left it in the car I didn't want to try to bring it in because then I'd no, I'd be tempted to try to take a bite out of it. But just here getting my hundred in for the day. I've got forty push ups in. Foot just cramped up. So gonna do another twenty. And then I'll probably just finish off with some core work. Whether it's abs or back extensions, I'm not sure. I'm gonna see how I feel. Body just kinda does you just kind of tell to do it, and okay, I'm gonna do it. Like yesterday, it's the abs. I just kept thinking about what abs do I do. And the more I thought about it, the more I just sat there. So I said, just start doing crunches. Okay, now do that. Done with that. Go to the side crunches. And so I'm sure once I start doing push-ups, I'll be like, okay, I need to do this more. I feel like this needs to get done. So I'll figure it out. But calling it a night. Me and the pup are laying down. She's right here. She's ready for bed, and so am I. I'm almost ready to doze off right now, but I was putting laundry away. Kind of woke me up. So I've got a little bit of energy left. Kind of use it to finish off the exercises for today and call it a night. So run your life with health and happiness, and have a good night.